Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nana and today we are playing some more Sims 4 Seasons. I have a busy day planned um, and it's a fun day. It's a Hopefully it's going to be a really fun day because it's Cassie's birthday. Cassie is hitting the big 30 today and that is a big milestone. That's, I think that's something that deserves to be celebrated um, big time and not because it's such an incredible number or anything but I think it signifies the, um, you know, coming of age. Savannah are both turning 30. They are born on the same day, same year, uh, which not only makes them best friends, but pretty much almost soulmates, which I think is totally the right word for these two because they're just, they're just so incredibly, uh, I love them together. They're Oh, I don't even know how to how how didn't even know how to explain that. I just love the two of them together. So already planned for later today, but um, I wore some things I wanted to do in the garden. If there's anything to do and uh, kind of freshen ourselves up, make ourselves look presentable before we come. People that are gonna be coming, hopefully. So let me just show you. So Salem recently got into the club, um, of the powerhouse, which is run by Marcus and Clara which are a couple if I'm not mistaken because Paolo, Salem, and then uh, Jay Huntington the third, I think and Johnny now powerhouse of course through Paolo now Cassie on the other hand has well this is officially not a group so this is just a quick way for me to have you know a girls night out with the girls you know come together and Savannah has connections everywhere Savannah knows Lilith and um Lilith Vator and Dina Caliente. Now, no, 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 no. Lilith is actually the sister of Caleb. Um, and Caleb is married to Johnny. So that's that was interesting. Johnny apparently is gay and all this time we had no clue. Uh, he never told us anything. And I'm kind of disappointed because I feel like it's not like something you should tell people. It's not like, hey, 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 I'm gay. You know, it's not like, you know, you need to throw it out there. But all this time, I've never seen him with anyone. I've been teasing him like, oh, when are you going to find a girlfriend? When are you going to find a wife? And now it turns out he doesn't even like girls. Like, I wish we knew earlier so we could have used the right pronouns and be like, oh, when are you going to find your boyfriend? Or, you know, when are we going to find a cute boy for you? But I guess he could... Oh wait, hold a second. I think he got married as well. I think he's yeah, a spouse. So he is married. He's not even just damn. He's not even like he's single. He's married. So he was married all all the, all day long. He was married all the damn time, and we didn't even know he was married. So we've been kind of like trying to, you know, couple him to random girls all while he was married. That's kind of weird. Sorry, Johnny, we didn't mean to. How small is this world? Damn, okay, I could talk about I could talk about things like that all day, but we're gonna have to go to the party in two minutes, um, two hours, and Salem decided to go to work. Salem, I'm really sorry, but today's not the right time for work, and our line just broke. Everything is going exactly, you know, as per usual. Now, quickly, I want to discuss and talk, not discuss, but I want to talk about her career because the end of the end of the um, and the end of this Let's Play is coming up. Like I said, I wanted to you know, move on with these Sims in Get Famous, but I do want to complete the aspiration um, and the career for you know gardening because I feel like that is a big part of seasons. So let's see if we can actually get her um, to level 10 in the last few episodes. That'll be kind of cool. Um, and also relationship with um, Patchy has gone up quite enormously. You mean Patchy the straw man. We're actually really, really, really good friends. So I want to see if I can tend my garden. Just she's kind of, um, I wouldn't say she's a nervous, but she maybe she's nervous she's feeling a little she's feeling some nerves how about that she's not nervous but she's feeling a little you know her stomach is kind of like how she has butterflies and all these things and it's not because of her birthday she's not afraid of the number she doesn't care about the number she feels honestly i feel like she's really grown to her age um not that 30 is really old but i feel like she's really grown um into a really strong independent woman 
but there's gonna be so much people that she actually hasn't met before so lilith is gonna be there and then dina is gonna be there who she doesn't know and then she really doesn't know johnny and jay huntington that well so she's feeling a little hesitant she's um she's not exactly sure of herself but that's just our old cassie cassie's just she's never been really good with a lot of people she's kind of awkward and i feel like even even salem is kind of like that but salem is more so just hmm, salem loves to be alone and cassie just doesn't know how to talk to people so one is just awkward and one just doesn't really like being social there we go <laughs> long explanation anyway yeah so they have arrived there were some latecomers like jay huntington and everything but the party's been going on for about two hours and savannah just brought out her cake and she has oh she is giving she is giving anaya a nasty look she's like how dare you come into my house anaya is here um with marcus of course marcus is summer i don't know here he is he's just sitting here and uh, we absolutely despise them and i think savannah kind of despises him as well but the reason that he's here is because well paolo really likes him so and he's in the club so i guess that's that's how it is right <laughs> that's how it is uh can i just can i just quickly do my appreciation for savannah Oh my gosh, first of all, she planned this entire party. I'll show you more of the, you know, everything, but look what she looks like. She's absolutely stunning. Oh my god, she is so pretty. And then we have Cassie in her dress. You know, Cassie's not one to dress up a lot. This is quite a big deal for her. Um, and then we have, you know, Dina and um, Lilith. And then here's Miko. And this is actually Savannah's dad, who we haven't seen in so long. Oh my god. Wait, who's gonna blow out the candles exactly? Is Savannah having her birthday? Who's going first? I don't know. Savannah's really feeling really stressed. Seeing Mark is here and everyone else is just kind of like, no, just, 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 no, I'm just, no, no, don't even know. But she's not trying to let that ruin. She's not gonna let that ruin the entire party or anything. Like, she's definitely, like, not gonna do that. That is that is the worthy of a thumbnail. Just 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 like that. There we go. Oh, we got an achievement too. Oh, look at that. Cassie A step adulthood fulfilling dreams planning for retirement and midlife crisis await the perfect time to start wrapping up those lifelong goals girl i am telling you you don't look a day older than 20 she's not 30 the big 30 oh, oh my gosh and let's do the same at birthday candles it's kind of like you know it's a little bit annoying that we have to wait for one another to kind of you know get this over with and blow the candles and that kind of like, that kind of thing but you know what no it's venice turn i love i just love oh cassie's like oh, yeah, i already had my turn i don't give a crap <laughs> Kissy Kissy is so funny. Oh my god. Savannah aged up as well. Joelle has sent Savannah a gift. Ooh, ooh, mama. She is so hot. Salem is over here playing with the two children of Miko. Of course, he feels a little bit awkward. You know how it is. He's like, mm, so many people. Savannah's come to join them. Savannah is like, oh my god. Oh my god. And take a look at that bajonker chunkers of a ring on her finger paolo knows what's good lilith must be a, you know must be a really nice girl um she seems she, she, she seems very sweet not talking about that oh my god we have not seen him uh in years it's been years ever since maybe like 10 years we haven't seen him he's not our daddy savannah's dad but we're like a daughter to him and um it's definitely like a bond we have to re you know reestablish but we're like oh my god like it's been so long she's changed so much this is savannah's a dad oh my god look at him look at him always in suit he's a businessman oh damn he is a snack oh that's a little too zoomed in just like savannah he's absolutely he's absolutely amazing he's just like a snack salem is trying to salem is such a sweet sweet dude he's like you know what i don't think they're really like popular with anyone but i'll just kind of chat with them i don't mind doing that doing any of that 
nobody's really eating or doing anything i guess everyone's just kind of doing their own thing and then upstairs uh it looks like dina maybe it'll be a little awkward as well dina is playing on the computer and then miko is hiding on the bath in the bathroom <laughs> the kind of situation there's some boxes downstairs is empty this is empty as well i mean that that's what i mean with downstairs is empty uh, duh, duh. <laughs> Oh, how, how, how do I put it? There is there is an end and a beginning to everything and I think that that is that in this case. Oh my god, I wish I could just send this woman gone. Like, I really don't want her here, but since this is my party, I really cannot afford to just, you know, cause drama and anything. Like, I just, I just, I just don't really feel like it. Girls, let's get some cake. I feel like we deserve some before everyone else takes it. It's our birthday. This pink cake, of course, because why would Savannah have anything else than a pink cake savannah is absolutely obsessed with pink is i think this one is having a blast um and maybe maybe there will be more of an adult kind of you know party after party maybe just a party with the two of them i feel like the girls should definitely go to a club or something together like celebrate it together just the two of them just like old days because they definitely have to celebrate something right like maybe go to a club or something i think that'll be really cool um, and then the next celebration they'll have will probably be Cassie's wedding. Oh my god, did I even tell you? She dyed her hair brown. Uh, this is her original hair color, her um, her base color. And, you know, the her that everyone knows, the real her. Because this blonde Cassie is kind of like her alter ego. It's the personality that she made up to feel more comfortable promoting her music. It's kind of like blonde Cassie stands for singing and music and all these changes. Wow, Jay, thank you for finally showing up and um i think that that's probably why she dyed her hair because she didn't want to get married to salem in her blonde you know her blonde hair so it's not something that you know she wants she just wants to look herself and that maybe perhaps if she goes back to music she'll dye it blonde again i mean you know that's how it is <laughs> oh my god i mean the two of them have come to this nightclub and it looks like the ladies have to hit at the bathroom at first thing is raining i was just quite a change i mean it was a lovely weather earlier and now it's just like really rainy the two of them oh oh no oh no i think she oh no she just oh my god i have to cheat this oh my god oh my god savannah oh my god i'll pretend i did not see anything where's cassie going exactly cassie has oh no just there she is okay she's going okay she's going to the bathroom no problem okay so let's just go over here and kind of wait for her i mean honestly you know that's what girls do they don't pee uh, alone mm -mm. maybe boys do but girls don't pee alone why would you pee alone that's just no that's a no all right we come to this nightclub absolutely love it and um, the two of us are gonna have you know spend our rest of our birthdays just together oh my god the party was fun but we deserve some time alone like oh my god it's been such order my favorite drink i i wonder if i i don't i don't think let's see what our favorite drinks are i think it changes so often oh my god she looks amazing <laughs> she she looks so great oh my god she's not been having the best day i must say um she's having a lot of doubts about her house and everything else but she's trying to relax despite everything and i oh my god oh my god i love you girls you're the best oh my god i love them and i can't believe they're adults now oh my god the next stage is literally dentals and <laughs> dentals dentures and diapers and sticks and no no that's maybe a little dramatic but you know what i mean 10 years ago we were celebrating the fact that we just moved out and you came to move you came to live with me and you just oh my god you were like we, we didn't even know what we were doing or we were trying to get famous and make a name for ourselves and can you believe it now we're 30 and uh, we have boyfriends and we're still best friends like, like i can't believe it and now we're gonna get to the next step and actually make our dreams come true like i think like we're at the perfect age now where you know it's either now or never you know what i mean like it's neither now or never it's not gonna it's not gonna happen if we wait a little 10 years i think like we're too old then not too well maybe i don't know i feel like they feel like they're too old to like 40 and then trying to get famous i think they're they think they're too old I'm excited to go to the excuse me i'm really excited to go to the next chapter with these two i am just really like 
I really want to see what the future has in hold for them and I really want to see them get their dreams and make them come true. I know for, for a fact that Cassie can be a great singer and she can definitely do everything that she wants to as long as she believes in herself and Savannah here really wants to be a famous actress and she has to battle up <laughs> against all these youngsters because most people I think that get famous get discovered early on and then they get trained and have professional help and all that and I feel like we're kind of old you know and trying to do it by ourselves and we're kind of you know we're already 30 i don't know i feel like we have a disadvantage if that makes sense but we'll see how it goes cassie is mostly nervous about her wedding now that it's coming up in like a week or two she's just like like oh my gosh just like <laughs> it's it's getting real it's just so flipping real and i don't know if i'm ready for that i i think i'm ready and you know savannah is obviously there to support her friend she's like girlfriend you have that you absolutely have this uh, 10 years ago i could have never seen you get married and you didn't care about boys they thought they were gross and now you're actually you know now you're actually oh my god did the thunder like light hit hit somewhere oh my god <laughs> and now you're actually getting like properly married girlfriend like i'm so proud of you so dancing we've been talking and smoking some bubbles for most of the part but i think mostly it's about having fun and being there and celebrating the fact that not only did we turn 30 our friendship has been alive for at least like what 20 years and i think that's really really important as well to celebrate and these new changes in our life i'm excited for that Anyway, I think I'm going to end this episode quite here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye!